Today, we will introduce the ramp model. This model is specially designed to realize ramp for different test applications. The model can be used for check pickup value, check drop off value, test the directional relay, and check the maximum sensitivity angle. Here is the drop down menu area. Here is the toolbar area. Here is the place for test items or test points. Here is the parameter setting area for each test item or test point. Here is the multi display area. Here is the task list display area. Here is the test result display area. Here is the state displayed area. Now, we do a residential grounding over current test to check the pickup value by using ramp model. In the parameter setting area, Firstly, we can edit the name of the test. We call it test1 here. After click enter button, the name will display immediately in the test item area. Here, we can select the different photo type or variable. We set phase A grounding fault here. And we set the variable as current here. We set the value of the fault voltage here. Each one of the positive voltage, negative voltage, and the residential voltage can be selected as the fault voltage here. Firstly, we set the impedance angle. And the real code variable. We set the current to real code here. System frequency is displayed here. Here, we can set the step control value, including start value. Stop value. Step value. And the step 10, we select the type here. There are three types available. Pickup value, pickup value plus drop off value. And the characteristic angle, we choose pickup value here. Click setting button to enter into the setting page. To set the setting value of zoom 1 of residential grounding fault here. The tripping time of the zone 1 is 0. And the setting value is 7 Ampere. Click OK to save and exit. Click parameter button to enter into the parameter setting page. To set the parameter value of the test, prepare time is the relay preparing time or resetting time. Prefault time is the relay waiting time.
Click OK to save and exit. Click the binary button to enter into binary setting page. We set chip A. B. C and the reclosing here. Click assessment to go to the criterion setting page. Here to set criterion. Both relative error and absolute error are available. Click wiring button, we can see wiring diagram. Left is our test set, and the right is the test object. The wiring diagram is made based on the information we put in message. We set phase A. B, C, Z, N of the voltage here. We set phase A, B, C, N of the current here. We set chipping A, B, C, and we closing here. We can set the remainder information here. We choose popping message before test. Click OK. We will get the connection diagram and it can help you to check wiring connection on the spot. Here, goose function is optional. For detailed information, please contact to Pernova. In the parameter page, click Add to add a new test point. After click OK, a new test point will be displayed immediately in the test eaten display area. Now, you can edit the setting of the newly added test point. If you want to delete test point, you just simply click remove button and click yes to confirm your option. The selected point will be removed from the test eaten display area. Click F2 to start the test. The wiring connection information will be popped up.
to remind you to check the connection. After carefully check the wiring connection, click OK to confirm and start the test. OK, the test is finished successfully, and we can get the pickup value in the test result display area. After test is over, the status will display for this item. Green plus sign means the result meets the criterion you set in assessment. Click the Save button in the drop-down list. User can save the report in their computer. In drop-down menu, there are two types of report for selection. RPT format and word format are available. This type of report does not allow any edit operation, and it contains also the template information of the model used. In the drop-down menu, we can select a setting to configure operation what to be included in the report. Select the items we want to include in the report and click OK to confirm the operation. Then, the new report is only content the items that you chose. The setting is effective in both format. We can also generate the word format report. This format is able to be edited by user itself. In the task list, select the Save as template file to save the template. Customer can use it at any time. You can close this testing. And reopen by clicking the template button in the start page. Selecting the template file from the folder where well, the template file was saved. All the test parameters and the settings in the saved template will also be uploaded here. That's all. Thank you so much for your attention.